What's going on guys, my name's Warrior, this is Warrior Plays, and today we're going to check out Vampire. Alright, so it is time to report back to Lord Redgrave about Dolores Fletcher. Yes. <clears throat> a leech! A leech! Ah, cat prewin. Oh, well, it's only level 18. I can take him. Where is it? There's a vampire, too, that I didn't know about. That sucks. <clears throat> hey, why are you shooting me? And you're dead. Oh, that sucks. Sucks for you. You got anything? No. You got anything? No. Of course not. All right. <clears throat> to Lord Redgrave. Ooh, piece of candy. I think I have to go this way anyway. Hang on. Nope, wrong way. Got to go this way. I don't think this is right. Nope, that's right. Okay. Do 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 Where is everybody? There's no one on the streets. How am I supposed to eat people if there's no people to eat? Oh, there's one. Mm, uh, he's a, I think he's a shop, the vendor. Maybe not. Who are you? Good evening, old chap. Are you all oh, it's the it's the pre-win guy. I should totally well eat him. I should totally eat him. Let's ask him some questions first. No, uh, hints. Hints. Alright, well, uh, let's just mesmerize him. Come on, buddy. He's the pre one guy, so let's go this way. One more vampire hunter off the streets. It's unfortunate that he and uh, Mr. Reed are school friends, but uh, yeah, I don't, I don't care. I need the XP. I've given up on trying to just save people. So if they are tasty and delicious, and I need the XP, and I think they're expendable, I'm gonna eat them. Should have known you were one of them, Johnny. Why was I so blind? Where do I need to go? Oh, that's that's where I needed to go anyway. But first, I'm gonna see if this guy's got any ammo for me, cause I need it. Good evening, Doctor. Good evening, Mister Guy, whose name I can't remember. Let's trade. Pieces of medicine and stuff like that. So uh, I'll worry about that then. Um, where do I need? Oh, we're here. That's not the right one. This is the right one. It's what are you doing here? Elizabeth, what are you doing here? I've been formally asked to witness your triumph, my dear. After all, isn't it the natural role of a woman to support her man in victory? Uh, it's you who insisted. I, I didn't know we were like that. Please forgive I mean, my dear. That's fine. I'm just overcome by the thrill of finally being allowed within these hallowed halls. You certainly have an inquisitive mind. It's quite something. Elizabeth Ashbury, only you can make me smile in these difficult. And Aww. the same to you, Jonathan Reed. Now go have your little chat with the chairman. I can see he's practically bursting to hear your report. Uh, 
can never remember where to go. There he is. Welcome back to the Ascalon Club, Lance Bearer. Thanks, Bobby. Please, Buddy. Good news. Bobby. Whatever. Have you put an end to the epidemic? My hypothesis was correct. Doris Fletcher was the source of the contagion in this part of town. She was probably the first to be infected. And you cleansed her before the hunters, I'd been told. Well done, Dr. Reed. You thrust your lance and pierced the very heart of the corruption. Giggity. I'm just a doctor. The important thing is, we won a major battle for the survival of London. For that, we salute you. Thank you. As you should. Now, I have another task for you. Of course you do. One of the utmost importance. Perhaps even more so than the previous. I'm listening. It's time for you to perform a most sacred duty for the club. I want you to recruit a new vampire. Recruit a new vampire? Are you sending me on some sort of diplomatic mission? Not exactly. I want you to make Aloysius Dawson the Ekon he deserves to be. Wait, he wants me to... It, I, no. I'm sorry, but I can't. Are you questioning my orders? No. It's just... I'm not sure I'm ready to have another progeny after what happened with my sister. The rebirth of Aloysius Dawson? is a necessary step in our campaign to ensure the safety of London. How would you like me to proceed? Aloysius is waiting for you at the Dawson Estate. Once the deed is done, I'll join you there to celebrate this momentous occasion. Um, I have Before questions. I, go, I have a few questions. All right, I'm listening. You damn right you are. Why Aloysius Dawson? Because he is about to die. And he just may be the most influential man in England. After me, of course. I mean, I guess that makes sense. Did he choose me? No, I did. My decision is very recent, to say the least. But it is entirely mine. I don't... You, you saying that it's entirely your decision doesn't lead me to believe it's entirely your decision. Does he know I'm coming? He can't wait to become your progeny, Dr. Reed. Especially now that you have shown how strong your lineage is through your sister. How would you like me to proceed? Don't worry. Aloysius has had many years to prepare himself. He has studied our kind for decades. I feel like this is a trap. This is all kinds of a trap. So shall I just let him drink my blood? Yes. Aloysius will gratefully sup on your blood. His heart will slow, then stop. But he will rise again as one of us, an immortal. Is there, any, is there danger? any danger? Our blood alters a mortal body so deeply that some don't survive the metamorphosis. They die for good. But Mr. Dawson has been preparing himself for a long time. Okay. You invited Lady Ashbury? You invited Lady Ashbury? Wouldn't that be breaking one of your cardinal rules? No women allowed. Not allowed as members, no. But considering the circumstances, I thought you'd like to have her here to witness your triumph. So it's a temporary admittance, then. Something of a bargain, considering the crisis we're currently facing. Hmm. Goodbye, Lord Redgrave. Alright, let's go ahead and make a baby vampire. Let's see how that goes. Probably not well. But we'll see. I don't know. We'll probably end up fighting something. I feel like I should spend some of this XP. Are you alright, Jonathan? I'm Lord I am ordered me to turn Aloysius Dawson. To make him my progeny. I see. And how do you feel about this? I'd like your advice on the matter. The real I don't really want to do it, but I feel like I have to. Has his lordship given you this task? Do you think it's some sort of trap? Of course it is. Really want to know what I think about this? I do. Yes. To make an immortal of a soulless blackguard like Aloysius Dawson will only lead to a disaster for London. 
the man is already dead inside. Should I refuse? Perhaps politely suggest that Lord Redgrave turn the man into a vampire himself. Don't you dare, my dear. According to what I've recently discovered, his lordship could kill you for even broaching the subject. Awesome. Why? I've recently found proof that the Earl of Bristol is of lesser lineage. Oh, really? Capable of creating skulls. Hmm. Please hmm. tell me more about your recent investigation. As long as you lower your voice. Are you sure your information about Redgrave is correct? He says he's the progeny of the great knight William Marshall, who lived some nine centuries ago. That's a lie. Lord Redgrave is unable to create anything but skulls, if the poor soul survive at all. How can you be sure the information was correct? I made the acquaintance of a most interesting informer while investigating your maker. Oh, really? Whom I learned the truth about Lord Redgrave. Why so vindictive? You suddenly sound like you're angry. Forgive me, Jonathan. I hate myself for it, but I feel such pride in my discovery. I'm afraid I just can't help it. Which is? He did serve William Marshall. And yes, the blood he covets as a token does truly belong to that legendary knight. But he was never his progeny. His lineage is not so noble. I need proof, woman. Give what me if proof. If I made Dawson an Econ like myself. You would add a powerful immortal into a suffering world. An immortal who already craves authority. Maybe I could teach him control, like you taught me. Lead him down the right path. Mr. Dawson spent his life searching for a way to cheat death. I'm sure he has spent decades dreaming of how he'd spend eternity as a tyrant. Goodbye. Yeah, I don't know what to tell you. I'm going to have to do the thing. Please be careful. Otherwise, this dude will kill me. So, whatever. <clears throat> oh. Right. Uh, I'm gonna go spend some of this XP. It looks like vampires have to obey Mendel's laws when producing progeny. Powers pass from one generation to another. That's why Dawson wants me to sire him. I'm going to spend some of this XP and then I'm going to head to the church. Alright, <clears throat> we are off to the church. Again, if I can see anybody, I will, uh, I'll see how... See what their blood is like and if it's worth taking. On account of the XP is needed. I think that's where I'm supposed to go. Nope, not where I'm supposed to go. Actually, what, what level are you? 26. How many are there? I don't know. I don't know. One, two. There's two of them. That's all right. What do you mean, am I deaf? You didn't say anything. Watch it. It's a killer. Yep. Yep. You're dead. Welcome to the world of tomorrow, where you are not in it, muha. <laughs> All right, that was dumb. I'm sorry. Please ignore that stupid joke. There's more of them. Crap. Um, I think there. I think there's too many. Um. All right, screw it. We'll uh, we'll see what happens. 
I'm on fire! Got him. Alright, it's a good thing I leveled up, man. Everything is so much easier when you're like, when you are an adequate level. Alright. I think this is, yeah, he should be around here somewhere. I mean, I think I could have just come in on the other side, but whatever. Yeah, this is this is all kinds of a setup. All kinds of a setup. Because there's lots of pre-win around, and there's a couple of scals floating around. Like, I feel like this is a setup. Can I get out over here? I don't... Hang on. I don't think I was actually supposed to come in here. I wasn't supposed to go in there. Oh well. It's locked all what right. The? I should find another way to get into the I door. should find <laughs> another way. Find a way to access Aloysius Dawson's mansion. Find a passage to get around the quarter teeth stockade. Okay. Um Alright, I guess I do have to go in there now. Yeah, combat is way easier now that I have, like, now that I'm properly leveled. This is fantastic. I mean, it helps, too, that I focused my XP expenditures on, uh, like, claws and shields and stuff. See if there's a way over here. Nope. Is there a window, perhaps? I think this passage could lead me close to Aloysius Dawson's mansion. What passage are you talking about? I don't see a passage. At least he's talking about this. Got anything up here? There's a vampire. Alright. That's cool, I guess. Level 30! This is my territory! 
He's over there. That's the one I need to fight. What the hell? What the? Get on out of here! Who you think you are? You know who I am? I'm Dr. Jonathan Reed, man. God! Ascalon Club is gonna be all up on you! Into the sewers, maybe? I'm not really sure what's going on here. I hear rats, though. I don't see them. Is there a map? Nope. <clears throat> um, there's one. Won't eat you, rat, and then Doctor Reed's gonna I bitch about it. I believe I'm doing this. Let's go this way. It's locked. It's locked. I have this thirst for blood. Just gonna make sure we uh, we explore down here. Um, I'd much rather find the crap that I need to make uh, syringes and medicines and that kind of. What the frig, man! I knew it was a trap. I knew it. Oh god. He just beat me, you son of a biscuit. No one can hide from Oh, that's that's the stamina one. That's not the one that I wanted. Oh, okay. I will Ow. So hard. Rock, no. I totally got out of the way before that could happen, but okay. Oh, my God. 
Ow. Get out of here. Need to keep a better eye on my life. Oh god, there's something there. Show me your power, you boy. Come on. Just gotta keep an eye on my life and I'll be fine. Kneel, traitor. traitor, what are you talking about? Get out of the way! Jesus. I could have bit him and I didn't realize it. Dang it. I'm gonna get him! I'm gonna get him! I got him! Yes! Only one try. It's pretty be it's pretty beast, man. It's pretty beast. You're not gonna drop anything for me? Of course not. Of course not. I think I go this way. With my luck this way I came in. I don't I don't know, maybe. Oh no wait. Do I go upstairs? I might go upstairs. I go upstairs. I cannot end locked. Oh no, that's the way I came from. Okay. That's fine. Is that the only door? It looks like that's the only door. Let's see if I can go up there for a second. Check out what's out over here. Hmm. Looks like a whole lot of nothing. That's okay. I'm not too concerned. Can't go that way. Soiled letter. My name is Robert Teasdale. To whomever may find this message, please try to help me. My daughter Lois, uh, or Louise, disappeared a few weeks ago. She's been seen the last part of the neighborhood. Blah, 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 blah. Louise's okay. father was determined to find and save her. Okay, I just went in one big circle. Uh, that sucks. Uh, Alright, let's go down here, I guess. I have no idea where I'm going. I'm lost in the sewers. Oh, did I find my way out? I think I might have found my way out.
What's this? All right, I found a new. Sp I found a new place. I just raised the water level, so that's a thing. It's locked, all right. Doors locked. Fantastic. Why are they always locked? Nope, I went the other way. Didn't want to do that. Nope, that went down too. I don't want to do that either. Can you go back up? Alright. It's locked. Why is the door locked? I'm supposed to be in here. Ow. Oh. Because it wasn't, the water wasn't up all the way. Alright, I guess that makes sense. So, I like that there are only a handful of puzzles in this game. What the? Why are there four of them? That's not fair. Ah, oh, he's on me! Ah, oh, he's on me! Got him! I just healed myself, you son of a biscuit. Get off of me! What the frig? Good lord! That was almost terrible. Alright, so I just went in a circle for some reason. I don't under I don't I don't under I don't understand. Like there's nowhere for me to go. Right? Or am I just missing it? Oh uh, okay. Those are stairs. Yep, that's where it stairs. Okay. Nobody was talking. I don't know what they said, but they said something. Lots of mice. This is despicable. Shut up. I have this. All right. Thirst I have of this blood. Thirst. I'll never be your wife. This is now my domain, young Eckhart. Are you gonna keep me locked in here? Oh, am I supposed to kill this dude? Ah! 
I'm working on it, lady. Jesus. Not very long. Don't worry. I'm gonna kill this guy who's trying to make you his wife. And then you can live hap happily ever after. Let me go, you bastard! Chill out, lady. I took care of it. He's dead now. You're welcome. Miss Teasdale, are you alright? How do you know my name? Who are you? My name is Dr. Reed. I managed to track you down thanks to your father. So my father really was looking after me. This man, this vampire, told me my father was dead. Is it true? I'm afraid so, miss. I'm so sorry for your loss. But you are but you're free, free to go. But you're free to go. Your abductor is no more. I suppose my jailer also killed my father, didn't he? Thankfully, he did not search your father's corpse, where I found his notes describing where he might find you. You should read them. I must find my father's body. He deserves a proper burial. Goodbye. Goodbye, Miss Teasdale. And be careful. Until we meet again. Now get out of the way so I can get this stuff. Alright. It's not where I thought I needed to go, but that's cool. I think I'm nearing the end. Yes, this is where I needed to go. I don't know. Who are you? Good evening, sir. Good evening. May I ask you what you're doing here at this late hour? I'm conducting none of your an goddamn business. The epidemic in this part of town. And who are you, sir? I'm Dr. Jonathan Reed from the Pembroke Hospital. May I ask who you are and why all the questions? I'm Detective Inspector Charles Albright from Scotland Yard. Ah. And I don't find your answers convincing. What is a Pembroke doctor doing in the West End at this time of night? I live here. I work for the Ascalon Club. Here is my permit to go freely about the city. Or I'll, the Ascalon Club. I'll do this, that's fine. You should have said so, sir. I must warn you, these streets are dangerous. And you'd better be careful. He's got Do you need sepsis. medical attention, Inspector? I'm afraid I may have caught something. I don't feel too well. You'll quickly feel better after taking this. Thank you, Dr. Reed. I really appreciate it. You should. I uh, can't mesmerize him yet. That's fine. Do you know anything in particular about a man called Aloysius Dawson? Who doesn't know the man? I think he intervened personally to put an end to the police strike of last August. What else can you tell me about him? Aloysius Dawson is exactly the kind of powerful and influential man who could commit murder and get away with it. With just one phone call. Really? That's good to know. Yeah, I'll talk to you more Goodbye, later. Goodbye, Detective Inspector Albright. Goodbye, Dr. Jonathan Reed. I'm sure we'll talk again soon. Alright, where's this dude's house? Oh, god dang it. Do you remember if we've seen someone recently? Sometimes it's difficult to remember why we're here in the first place. Who who are the twins? Good evening, sir. I am Dr. Jonathan Reed. Do you need my help? Yes, please. Would you be kind enough to tell me what the time is? That's all you need to know. Well, is it not important to know? As important as where you are? Or who you are? I suppose you're right. And who are you then, sir? I am Agamemnon Baker. Like my brother, I think we need to leave this city immediately. And my brother and I rarely agree on anything. Then why are you still here? 
May I ask what you're doing outside at this hour of night? I don't know. You should ask my brother instead. It was his idea in the first place. You must have your own ideas. From what I have managed to understand, I guess we're supposed to wait here. Waiting for someone to come. All right, so I'm going to I'm going to come back and talk to these guys once I'm done getting into this mansion. It's locked, all right. How am I supposed to get in with the door's locked? Come on. I don't think this is the mansion. I think this is a church. Yeah, that's a church. All right. Mansion is on the outside somewhere. Where are you, Mr. Dawson? Can't go that way. Um. I mean, I will, I will gladly loot the room, and I am now happy to find a. Uh, a shop. It's locked. Good evening, sir. Um. I don't know where this dude's mansion is. at all. Back in this I didn't realize I was going to run into this dude. Okay, how do I get into this guy's house? Maybe this is it. Maybe this... No, that's not it. Well, there's three of them over there. Not what I want to take care of right now. So, we're going to try going around them. I don't know where this guy's house is, and the map is not helpful at all. For all I know, this is the dude's house, but I can't get into it because there's those guys there. Lisa, can't let you through. All right, I'm gonna try to get around them with my vampire powers, and we'll see what happens. I can't use it yet. That's great. Uh, why is it on cooldown? I just equipped it. Oh, that's annoying. Um, that's got to be where the dude's house is. Like, I can't. This big part over here is a church. That that right there is a church. <clears throat> really? What the f God damn it. Like, why is it the highlighted area? Like, why isn't that where his mansion is? Come on. 
Like, why even have it highlighted if that's not where I'm supposed to go? Gotta go this way, I believe. Nope. Not yet. Oh, uh, what's... Okay, sorry. Game, uh... Game did something real quick. is okay I don't know if this is actually where his mansion is or what but cause like I think yeah this is just the yeah no that's just the thing to the, the passage or whatever I will see if they know where this dude is. Hello again, Dr. Reed. What can you tell me about Aloysius Dawson? You should ask that question to my brother instead. Personally, I've not seen Aloysius for many years. Okay. Goodbye for now, Mr. Baker. Good evening, sir. I'm Dr. Reed. Can I be of assistance? Dr. Reed? Dr. Reed? Is there anything wrong? No, it's just... Your name sounds familiar. And your face. Have we met before? I think I would remember. So I suppose the answer is no. That's odd. I'm certain I've already heard of you. My name is Pericles Baker. Does that mean anything to you? I'm afraid not, sir. But it's a pleasure to meet you anyway. Hmm. The pleasure is mine, I guess. I only wish I could remember when it was that we met. Yeah, I got nothing. What can you tell me about Aloysius Dawson? I've heard this is a man who has searched for his place in the world for a long time. I hope he found it. That, thank you for having no help at all. Goodbye. Goodbye. Like, that's a shop. That can't get in there. This is nothing. Keep out. That's, this is a hideout. Which is fine, but I don't need the hideout. I need this dude's mansion. Just the the first. Ah, it hurts me. Ah, I don't have any blood. That's awesome. Now this is the only one left. Okay. Now let's see if one of these is where I need to be.
Is this the mansion like I thought it was? Alright, I guess I'm in his mansion. Enter Al Al Alostius Dawson's mansion. Dawson's mansion. Uh, okay. Here I am at last. That was random. But the question remains. Am I ready to make a dying man my progeny? It doesn't matter if you're ready. If you don't, you're gonna get got. So, like always, we're gonna loot the room first, and then I will uh, go talk to the dude. It's got a nice house. Not seeing anything else that's worth taking. Alright, I give up. Where is he? He's downstairs, but I'm gonna, again, just continue to loot. Ah, I found him. Finally, you're here, Dr. Reed. What took you so long? I had to pass several of your barricades and outposts to access your mansion, sir. Death, pestilence surround us, and time is against me. I see you've gathered some of the most expensive, albeit experimental, blood transfusion equipment available. All this could be so useful in a hospital. Yes, yes. Since Lord Redgrave sent me a doctor to perform my conversion, I thought you might find some of these devices useful. Most thoughtful. But tonight I'm not here as a physician. But I feel reassured that a specialist such as yourself would help me to escape the Reaper. Very well. But before I proceed, I have a few questions for you. If you must, but be quick, for I don't have much time left in this life. Hmm, First of all, okay. I need to be sure that you know exactly what is going to happen to you, sir. I can assure you I'm as informed as any man can be. I have planned for this moment, Dr. Reed. Planned very carefully. Believe me, there is a huge difference between reading about vampires and waking up as one. I learned that myself the hard way. Oh my god, man, stop your whining. I don't have time for your pointless jibber-jabber. I will become your maker. Do you understand what that means? Well, I certainly won't consider you my liege or some such drivel. You can be assured of that. You'll need to feed on warm blood. Blood from mortals. How do you feel about that? I'm rich, Dr. Reed, and powerful. I'm sure I'll be able to acquire all the blood I need without ever having to sully my own hand. Alright, I don't want to do this, but I'm going to have to. What do you know about the Guard of Prewin? What I do know is that I'll crush anyone or anything that would dare to oppose me. Right, let's, let's move, move on, on then. then. Please, I'm cold and tired. I feel my life waning with every moment. But first, before you embrace immortality, what would you do with such a gift? That's a rather impertinent question, Dr. Reed. And I will do as I please. Answer me all the same. What will your first action be as an immortal? To save London. I will finance the most efficient quarantine ever seen. I will build a wall that will separate the sick boroughs from the healthy ones. That's not going to work, stupid. You really plan to build a quarantine wall across London? Yes, 
It will be tall and strong, separating the wheat from the chaff. By doing so, you will also create two separate prisons. Come, sir. An eminent doctor like yourself knows that such radical measures have proved efficient in the past. Who gave you the right to decide the fate of thousands of people? My money. My money and my pending immortality gives me the needed authority, Doctor. I'm a businessman. I'm used to tough decisions. Quarantine is not a bad idea, medically speaking. But I'm convinced this epidemic will not be contained by mere walls. As long as the right people are on the right side of the wall, that's all that matters. This sounds, uh... It sounds a lot like a certain president, you know. I've heard enough. It's time to proceed. At last. All right, do what you have to do. If it hurts, so be it. I've been preparing such a long time for this. Sacrifice 2000 XP. What the flip? I don't even want to do... If I... If I don't do it... The Ascalon Club is going to get pissy. If I do do it... I have to sacrifice XP? This is nonsense. Oh... Uh, oh, man. Um... Uh... I, I'm not doing you it. You don't deserve immortality, Mr. Dawson. What? What are you prattling on about? I don't believe I've ever met a man so bereft of empathy. You, sir, are despicable. No! Wait! You can't! I made a deal with Lord Redgrave. I'll finance whatever he wants. Please, just ask him. Sleep now. Rest now. Forever. That's right, Jonathan. You tell him. my fate who gave you the authority sacrifice 2000 xp you got to be kidding me Killed him. Is it done, Dr. Reed? Is Aloysius Dawson reborn as expected? Alas, Aloysius Dawson was not brought back to life after his death. The man is gone. What? What happened? He didn't survive the procedure. He was too weak. This is unacceptable, nevertheless. You were given the simplest task. Well, get rid of me then. From now on, you're an outcast. Banished. You are forbidden to ever appear in front of us again. Ascalon will smite you on sight, and your heart will be thrown to the rats. I'll leave you then. Have fun with your puppets and shadow plays, Lord Redgrave. Yes, go, traitor. And take that awful creature, that counterfeit of a woman I saw waiting for you, and what be gone. What does that even mean, that counterfeit of a woman?
We meet again at the strangest of times, young Econ. So do you serve the Earl of Bristol now? Old Bridget? What are you doing here? Your friend, the wise Econ. She sent me to warn you. Lady Ashbury? You know her? Tell me what's going on. The lady approached me but a few nights ago, wanting to meet the Sewer Skulls. Once she questioned Harriet Jones, she agreed to help us. Harriet Jones is still with you then? How is she doing? Harriet remains angry, but is recovering slowly. That's good. Her mind is twisted, but at least her body is healing. Tell me what is going on. The lady asked us to keep an eye on your mortal doctor friend while you were away. We spotted the hunters. They were discussing plans to attack tonight. No time to lose, then. I must go there right away. I shall return to my den. Have you a message for the lady? Should I see her before you? Yes. Tell her I love her. Is this still unknown to her? Go now and take care, young Ekon, for the flames are rising. Thanks for coming out, guys. If you liked what you saw, go ahead and click that like button, leave a comment, and subscribe. And if you are subscribed, make sure you click that notification bell so you don't miss anything. I put out new videos Monday through Friday.